a year ago tonight, Southeast Texas, many of us had no idea what was coming. No idea that Tropical Storm Imelda was about to unleash more than 40 inches of rain on our region. And now with this new threat in the Gulf, anxiety is high. 12 News reporter Amelia White talked to some of our leaders today to put it all in perspective. A year ago today, Southeast Texas wasn't a place many people could recognize. According to Orange County Judge, he felt like he was at an aquarium rather than his own town. It's sad. Nobody expected it. You know, we didn't never thought that it would happen again. And a lot of people, most people that were uh, flooded don't have flood insurance because they're not in flood zones. There is a price that comes with living in Southeast Texas. You got to know when you live there, that there's a potential for these things to happen, these storms to happen. And, and on this day, Tropical Storm Imelda happened, the storm that made Southeast Texas adapt to a new normal. And this is what many people woke up to a year ago. More than 40 inches of rain, homes destroyed, and valuable items gone. These disasters keep coming one after another and we don't get a break. Uh, you know, people are, it, it wears you down. While some are reflecting on Imelda's damage, others are focused on recovering from Hurricane Laura and maybe even trying to prepare for what's to come next week. But just stay prepared. I mean, stay ready. These storms pop up uh, and... You know, today can be sunny, the calm uh, gulf a week from today, we can be evacuating. So we just need to be prepared. Coming up at 6, a local business owner takes me down memory lane. He shares with me how many hurricanes his business has been through and how he stays resilient through it all. In Beaumont, Amelia White, 12 News. All right, Amelia.